Hello and welcome back. Today we are counting down the top 10 movies of the talented and stunning Blake Lively. Known for her versatile acting skills and stunning beauty, Blake Lively has become a household name in Hollywood. So without further ado, let's get started with our list. Starting off our list at number 10 is The Shallows. A thriller film about a surfer who is stranded on a rock after being attacked by a great white shark. Black Lively delivers an impressive performance as the lead character Nancy, who must fight to survive against all odds. At number 9, we have The Sisterhood of the Traveling Pants, 2005, a coming-of-age comedy drama film based on the popular novel of the same name. Blake Lively plays the role of Bridget, one of the four friends who share a pair of magical pants that fits them all perfectly. Coming in at number 8 is Cafe Society, 2016, a romantic comedy drama film set in the 1930s Hollywood. Blake Lively plays the role of Veronica, a beautiful socialite who catches the eye of the lead character Bobby. At number 7, we have All I See Is You, 2016, a psychological thriller film about a blind woman who regains her sight and starts to discover unsettling things about her marriage. Blake Lively delivers a powerful performance as the lead character Gina, who is struggling to come to terms with her newfound sight. Forget what I said. What I want whatever you want. Give me a like fucking that. minute. Please. I gave you a fucking minute, baby. Please, just please, get dressed. Please, just leave me alone. You just get I dressed can't fucking work. see. Coming in at number 6 is A Simple Favor 2016, a mystery thriller film about a mummy vlogger who becomes embroiled in a web of secrets and lies after her best friend goes missing. Blake Lively plays the role of Emily, a stylish and enigmatic woman who disappears under mysterious circumstances. Watch those bewitched reruns on TV land and I always thought it was so classy when Darren would come home from work and Samantha would fix him a martini. So every time we do this I feel so high tone. <laughs> My god you're such a nerd. <laughs> oh fuck this I need a real martini. This one's not real? Nope. Sean and I had the real thing at Dukes of London. The key? At number 5, The Age of Adeline, 2015. This is a romantic fantasy drama film about a woman who stops aging after an accident. Blake Lively plays the role of Adeline, a woman who has lived for over a century and must learn to let go of her past to embrace the present. Would you like a drum roll? <laughs> Voila! It was between this and stuffed quail. Please don't tell me you're disappointed. I, uh, I'm truly overjoyed. Yes. <laughs> Dig in. Okay. Coming in at number four is Green Lantern. 2011, a superhero film based on the DC Comics character of the same name. Blake Lively plays the role of Carol Ferris, a skilled pilot and the love interest of the lead character Hal Jordan. At number 3, we have The Town, 2010, a crime thriller film about a group of bank robbers in Boston. Blake Lively delivers a standout performance as Krista, a drug-addicted single mother who is the ex-girlfriend of one of the robbers. What are you doing down here? Slum. I work for the FBI. Me too. You used to hang around with Doug McCray a little bit, huh? How do you know Dougie? We sort of work together. 
Coming in at number 2 is Savages 2012, a crime thriller film about two marijuana growers who are forced to work for a Mexican cartel. Blake Lively plays the role of Pelia, a girlfriend of both growers who is kidnapped by the cartel. And finally at number 1 we have The Gossip Girl 2007 to 2012. The hit television series that launched Blake Lively to stardom. In the show, she plays the role of Serena Vander Woodsen, a popular and wealthy socialite in New York City. And that's a wrap on our countdown of the top 10 movies of Blake Lively. We hope you enjoyed our list and discovered some new movies to add to your watch list. Which Blake Lively movie is your favorite? Let us know in the comments below. And if you haven't seen any of these movies yet, we highly recommend giving them a watch. Thanks for tuning in and we will see you next time.